pal decks. Tell me about the Chikapee pal. This is a tough one. Let's see if it can get it. Chikipi is a neutral element pal that can lay eggs when assigned nice. to a ranch. Drops include egg and chikipi poultry. Pal decks. Tell me about the Mamorist pal. Mamorist, grass type pal, can be ridden, skilled in cutting trees and mining. I can't believe this is working. <laughs> this is wild. I feel like I'm in the future. So I've been hacking on an AI assistant bot that can help me while I play Pal World. Uh, it's voice prompted. It can pull data back from the wiki and the internet while I'm playing, uh, and then it reads the responses back to me. We've been hacking on it for a few weeks. It's been working really well. We just added that voice piece and we've wired it up so the lights in the room actually illuminate while it's responding. Uh, it's been super cool. I can interact with it, and while I'm streaming, Twitch chat can interact with it as well. Check it out. Okay, should we fire this thing up? Give it a shot? Let's see. Yarn run dev. Pal decks. Tell me about the T-Font pal. Water element pal. Partner skill. Soothing hey. shower heals players HP. Nice. The lighting works. That's so cool. <laughs> pal decks. Tell me about the Mamorist pal. Mamorist, grass type pal, can be ridden. Skilled in cutting trees and mining. I can't believe this is working. <laughs> this is wild. I feel like I'm in the future. Pal decks, tell me about the lamb ball pal. Lamb ball is a neutral type pal with the partner skill fluffy shield and can drop wool. Tell me about the tansy pal. Grass element pal uses assault rifle. Drops include mushrooms. Tell me about the cremis pal. Pal decks. Cremis is a neutral element pal known for its fluffy fur, which it uses to sleep. It's timid, runs from players in the wild, and prefers ranch work. Drops wool. Nice. <laughs> Pal decks, tell me about the Chikapi pal. This is a tough one. That's a weird word. Let's see if it can get it. Chikipi is a neutral element pal that can lay eggs when assigned nice. to a ranch. Drops include egg and Chikipi poultry. Pal decks, tell me about the Gumos pal. Gumos is a grass ground pal that aids in logging. Drops, berry seeds, Gumos leaf. Dope. Could you please complete your question? What's the fastest mount in Pal World? Jetragon is the fastest flying mount. Paldex, how do I craft PAL metal ingots? Craft PAL metal ingot at an electric furnace with four ore and two paldium fragment. Paldex, how do I craft carbon fiber? Craft carbon fiber at production assembly line using two coal or five charcoal. Nice. So for those of you curious on how this is working, we are actually pulling live subtitle data off of the stream. Here, that's what this is. And we're taking that, looking for specific keywords, uh, in this case, Paldex. Um, and when we get that, using that data to generate a prompt, then we're taking that prompt and we're calling the Pal World fandom with that prompt. It uses MediaWiki, so we can call it with an API. Um, then we're taking the data that that returns, then we are calling OpenAI's text-to-speech models. So right here, this OpenAI provides these really nice text-to-speech APIs that we can use. But then, in turn, call my lighting setup over here uh, via a little API I wired up, where essentially this uh, LED strip I've got behind this shelf is all controllable via a JSON API. So then we just call the JSON API with certain scenes, so when the voice starts speaking, it actually will switch that to like the voice talking scene and then switch back to the scene that was there previously. And we can like compute the length of the speech using some metadata on the MP3 files that get returned by the text to speech. Uh, but anyway, this is kind of the final form and it's all working super well. If you think this kind of thing's cool and you'd like to come check it out further, you can uh, catch me live on stream um, or hop in the Discord. I'll have links to both in the description below so you can come join us, mess around with the bot. Uh, see if you can break it with me and, uh, yeah, we'll have a good time.